Hi, I'm Joe. I'm Sam. And you're watching Living, Living on, on Travel. Hey guys, we're at Ocala National Forest. Uh, we were actually out here last time and forgot to record. Um, so we got some new equipment for the videos. Uh, so I hope that the audio and video is a lot better. Um, we're gonna go explore around a little bit, um, show you guys a few landmarks, and I hope you guys enjoy. Stay <music> guys so we are now at grassy prairie it's such a beautiful day out here um, the wind's blowing the sun isn't out too bad um, so it's not that hot it's just so pretty
have now arrived at the Kirkpatrick Dam in the Ocala National Forest. Um, I didn't even know this existed, lived in Florida my whole life. Um, we're gonna get out, walk around, take a few videos and see what it's about. On this part of the video, uh, we actually show you a little campground called Delancey West. Um, it's just a small little campground, um, nothing too crazy. It's right on the water. Uh, doesn't seem like you can actually access the water from it. There might be some little tiny trails that let you, but as far as we know, you can't. And this is where we had lunch, just a cute little diner, a pizza place called Salt Springs Pizza. bombing range for the US Navy um, they have a lot of the area closed right now like back this way is where we were gonna go um, there's a little prairie out there we went last time um, but obviously it's closed due to I think they're gonna be using the bombing range so um, if you are coming out here you do need to be aware of that um, and the dates that they're gonna be using it um, I found it on the uh, website for the Ocala National Forest um, and it tells you all the dates and everything. Um, and a lot of people use this spot as like a meetup point, um, just a place to take some cool pictures. Uh, it's pretty cool to have that in the background. Um, but yeah, I uh, just wanted to explain that and show you this spot. So, um, yeah, ready? it's pretty cool. Um, there's actually signs like all down the road, like around the whole border pretty much telling you that there's like lasers and um, like radiation, unexploded bombs. Um, so I think it's just kind of cool. So yeah. Um, that we talked about in our previous video um, and you're considering a yellow trail definitely want to be precautious of so how much sand the yellow trails, most of the yellow trails we go down are fine but this trail was not um, it like leads to a pond I'll post a picture of what trail to warn you about because it's straight sugar sand and as you can see behind me, it's just nothing but sugar sand. And there's a lot of there's a lot of there. uphills, like where you have to you cannot stop. Um, you might hit the ceiling and a few if you times. Like your paint, I suggest you not go down this trail because it's gonna scratch it up pretty good. Um, so just be careful of that. Um, be careful of this trail. Like I said, I'll post it up on the screen. And like I said, it's just sugar, sugar sand and you're gonna either get stuck. I would definitely not take a car down here. Yeah. Um, Something with four wheel drive, probably. Yeah, cause it's pretty bad. I mean, I didn't use four wheel drive to get where we're at, but we felt like we were in a 
Ford Raptor Baja commercial <laughs> to get back here. So. I mean, it's beautiful out here, but it's a rough ride getting out here. I'll definitely say that. <laughs> have an H, what is it? H-O-V? Um, something like that. It, whatever <laughs> it is. For side um, by sides and yeah. four wheelers. And the head of the trail is right directly across from us over there. There's bathrooms. Um, I'll insert a clip of, of the bathrooms. Um, it has showers, a uh, place for you to wash your dishes, all that. Um, it's really pretty. It's Not twenty dollars. Um, yeah. A lot of people bring their campers and stuff here, but I would say you don't have to because, like I said, they got showers and um, a place to wash your dishes. Pretty so. much anything you would really need. They even have yeah. like a fire pit and um, uh, benches at every single one. So they also have a RC car track in the very front up there by the road. Um, yeah, I think it's really cool. Um, might rain tonight. So. Yeah, it's looking pretty nasty. Yeah. So. All right. We just wanted to show you guys our campsite. Obviously, the bathrooms, um, big stalls, very clean. Um, and then each of the bathrooms have showers, pretty big showers, very nice. Um, and then between the restrooms, there is also a dishwashing station, which is pretty cool. And here is our fancy primitive <laughs> turkey and cheese roll-ups. We got strawberries. We also have jam and pickles, crackers, and peanut butter. Yeah, we're rocking we're on the turkey end. cheese stick, not actual cheese. I forgot. The I cheese. mean, it's actual cheese, but it's a cheese stick and turkey <laughs> and a, a tortilla shell. <laughs> on every corner luckily they have those out here um we are trapped in here until they let us out yeah we're hoping it's eight o'clock because yeah. it's 7 48 right now and we can't leave because the gates are closed <laughs> and they don't we, have any signs posted yeah. stating that hey you're not going to be able to get out till we let you out. out and so. we did not bring anything we have stuff for breakfast, but not like breakfast foods. We have like crackers and peanut butter and stuff, but I really don't want to eat that. <laughs> I want breakfast. But so hopefully we'll be getting food before too yeah. long. So. All right, guys. So we found out it's eight o'clock that they finally let you out. Funny story, big old gate, dummy lock. We're the dummies. <laughs> <laughs>
So we found this lake yesterday, uh, but there are people here. I think it's because this was a boat ramp and we didn't really want to mess with the people if we were just going to be like videoing it. Um, but this is called Sailor's Lake. Sellers Lake. Sellers? Sellers Lake. Okay. Um, but it's pretty big, but the, the boat ramp to get down here, you can't tell, it's pretty muddy, but yeah. Oh. That side. So there's just a little path. Yeah. Hey guys, so at this point uh, we actually had forgotten to record an outro. Uh, so we just wanted to thank you guys for watching. Uh, we hope you enjoy our content. And if you could like and subscribe, that'd be awesome. All right, see you on the next one. Also, if you guys know of any other places that we should explore, please comment down below.